Hey everyone, good morning and welcome to an episode of the Daily D. Today's the birthday edition. <laughs> Today is my birthday. I'm 37 years old and I wanted to share the thought or the concept of celebration today. So I've never been a celebrator. <laughs> you know, I've always said I want to celebrate something, but I've never been good at it. Let's just say that. I've never had a creative energy to, to, to celebrate things. It's just been in me for years to kind of celebrate things and let other people celebrate me and I think more so it's probably my as a kid I I guess I felt like I couldn't celebrate a lot of things because I don't know I didn't I didn't feel like I was uh, worthy of celebration could have been that maybe as a young adult um, I felt like celebration celebrating oneself was a negative thing um, can be because I think that celebration takes away from your focus you know, I've never really been a celebrator. I just, I've never been that guy. I have thought I was, but it's hard for me. It's hard for me to let go. It's hard for me to let go of things. And, and sometimes I like to, sometimes I feel like it's my ego in the way as well, because sometimes I feel like some people should celebrate um, things that are really important and maybe not me. And maybe I feel like, maybe, maybe my ego gets in the way and says, maybe people should celebrate me and I shouldn't celebrate myself. You know, these are the, the thoughts that go through my head when I want to celebrate something. So... Here, here's one thing I know, okay? I have never, ever felt more alive in my life. And I have never felt more alive working than I do any other way. Working is my distribution of talents. It's what puts me in a good mood, what puts me in a good place, what show, showcases what I'm good at and makes me feel confident in life and in the world. You know, today's a day most people, if it's celebrating a birthday, would say, I'm going to take off of work. <laughs> I'm going to go out and drink some good drinks and eat some good food and be with my family. Well, all those are good things, and I'm not going to say I won't ever do those things. I'm just going to tell you that today is a Thursday, and i got to work. And I believe that's the thing that I get to do today for my birthday. I think that's my gift. I think my gift today, my birthday present, is my ability to go out and push and make some money and coach some people and deliver a, a product or a service to, to the world and that could be just my distribution of my talents and I am blessed to be able to do that each and every day but most importantly I'm blessed to do it today I don't think I should say well because it's my birthday I need to take the day off I need to relax I need to chill you know why why should I wait a whole year to do that when I can create a life that just feels that way anyways I don't need to wait all year to celebrate a day. I need to celebrate life every day. And I celebrate that through my work, through my through through that channel, through that energy. And I've this isn't to preach to you, this is just me sharing how I felt. I feel that it's my duty and obligation, if you will, to get up and show up and give to the world. And that's my present. I think that's the greatest gift I could ever receive. And the greatest gift that anybody could ever give me in return is 100% of their energy, their time, their commitment. Because if I'm committed, they should be too. If we're meeting, we, we should meet in a committed setting. If we're delivering something, we should deliver it committedly. I think that's, that's the beauty of life. I think that's where we deserve to be and I think that's what we should be doing. Celebration doesn't have to be a party. Celebration needs to be celebrating life by soaking it in, <laughs> you know. When I was a kid, I could never have dreamed this. And that's because I don't think I'm done yet. <laughs> this is the beginning. I'll tell you that I am more committed this year in 37 years than I've ever been committed to doing a lot of things. One of them is building a legacy, building a family, building bigger businesses, contributing to the world, feeding more families, giving back to the communities we serve. I've, been, I've never been this committed in my life. Every year I get better. I get stronger, I get faster, I get smarter. And this isn't because, uh, uh, you know, because it's accidental. It's an intentional plan every single year. In fact, this morning as I got back from the gym, the first thing I did is wrote down my commitments for 2021, which is really 37 years old. And I said, this is what I need to do, and this is what I need to do, and this is who I need to become, and this is how I need to do it. And I said that because, to be honest with you guys, man, the world isn't accidental we don't accidentally become successful we don't accidentally get some great things we actually we don't do any of that accidentally everything's intentional everything happens for a reason it's our own destiny that we shape it's our acceptance of 
the consequences of our actions is really important, right? We're all self-made, even those who aren't very happy about it. <laughs> you got to accept it. We got to move forward. So 37 years I've been on this world and this planet, and I can't think of a better time to be alive. I think I'm blessed. I think you're blessed because we have the ability to watch this and talk and I get to, to speak to you. But more importantly, I think we're blessed because there's so much more to do in the world. Don't let it stop you. Don't let a day stop you. Don't let the time stop you. Time is on our side. I wish you nothing but health, wealth, success, but most importantly, freedom. God bless you guys and have an amazing day.